She's got the Christmas Chronicles one starred. Oh no, this is Bell Snickle. Bell Snickle! So, I love it. She's cracking me up. So today is really just kind of getting back to normal tasks. Did you follow me, boo? Oh, it's so Christmassy in this view. Um, anyway, we are going to do our regular Monday things, which is laundry. I've already picked up all the laundry from upstairs, brought it down, sorted it, got my first load in. Uh, got me a cup of cheer because you know that's the season I don't have a Christmas cup but I have I, I have too many I have plenty of cups Are you eating a crab rangoon yeah I love them I know you do <laughs> they don't have cheese in it yes they do so I don't eat those daddy likes them that's exactly what happens around this one people eat those <laughs> okay so I am focusing on catching up stuff. Laundry, because I just didn't make it through. I think I did like four loads and then I was just like, I'm done with this. Um, so we're gonna get that all caught up. I have Christmas wrapping that each girl needs to come up and do with me. I'd just rather do it myself, but whatevs. Um, that needs to happen sometime today or soon. Um, I have editing to do because as you see, there was a gap in my every day in December. Um, I have two hauls. I have my mini haul from midweek, which maybe I did on Wednesday afternoon, maybe I did on Thursday. I don't know, I can't, I can't remember. Like there was no brain, there was very little brain power that was happening. <laughs> Bell Snickle? Bell Snickle? Yuck to uh, Kate. <gasps> All right, go go watch some Bell Snickle. So I need to edit some videos. Obviously, I'm filming because I need to film. Um, it's much worse problem to have to edit than to film because when you edit, at least you have content that's ready that you can bang, bang, bang out. And hopefully I'm going to try to have a haul today. And then, I don't know, because Wednesday should be my ads. I don't know if I want to do. And then try to get this out for tomorrow. I don't know. No, I'm going to set this down because it just makes me happier to do that. Um, I feel like I probably yammered about 20 minutes already. I didn't set down. I set out to just film a whole thing. I set out to do a vlog today where I'm like bringing you along with me with the stuff that I'm doing. So, But it might be that I just spilled all the beans at least for the purpose of this video, so. Oh. Mommy, what? I don't want cheeses. What's your favorite cheese? The cheese. Cream cheese? Yeah, and pizza cheese. Mozzarella? Mm -hmm. Pizza cheese? Mm -hmm. All right. Don't know me. <laughs> I know you know my tippy top. You, you are in your tippy toes? All right, so I'm going to let you go for now. Bye. This may or may not be the end of the video. You probably will know. Peace out. I can see your little nose. Say peace out. Peace out. There we go. All right. We'll see you soon. So it's morning again, and here I am folding laundry. This, this is like three loads that I kept putting in the basket. I'm trying to get these things folded and put away. What? And then there's still one here that's gotten mixed in with the Christmas stuff. But it just needs to be put away. So that's what I'm working on now. Okay, so I just folded the stuff that you saw. And then I went and got the basket that was around the corner here in the Christmas stuff. I thought that was just a basket with folded stuff in it. No. <laughs> It was a basket full of clean clothes that had not been folded. So I brought that over. And just as I was finishing the original batch, I heard the dryer go off that it was done. And I was like, <laughs> but on a good note, it did make the kids put away about half of the clothes that belonged to their room. 
I did one and then they did, I did a load, they did, each did a load and we went around. So I guess maybe they did two thirds of it. A little, tiny bit of help, but the point is, is it was not much. So then I got that basket, which was all upstairs clothes, folded it. And now this is the basket of stuff that needs to go upstairs. So then I went downstairs because again, the dryer beeped. Look, it's like Christmassy. Um, and got the dry clothes out of the dryer and I waited because it was on the final spin and it just beeped the washer with the last load. Put that in the dryer, so that's drying now. And um, I folded that load, which is also in here. It's like Daddy, mostly all this top. Look, it's mommy's little present. Yeah, I think you can do. I know, I think this is gonna be the last season we get to wear that shirt, but it's about perfect for today, isn't it? You're pretty darn cute. I'm thinking I know both. I know. So anyway, that's where I'm at. I probably should go up and put this away because, dude, you're going to knock my clothes over and that's going to make me angry, mom. <laughs> Arr, here, get your stuff. I'm going to sit down. Anyway, so um, I'm just waiting for that dryer to get done because finishing the laundry is like one of my main goals today. Um, I need to do some Christmas cards. Do I care if they're late? No, no, I don't. Um, it's almost better if they're late because, um, it's like a little bit of joy after the fact because like there's always kind of like that letdown for after Christmas and then bleh, like nothing sort of a thing. So maybe they'll get there between that break, between that New Year's, but after New Year's, it's like totally like drear and all that stuff. So, um, oh i tell you about my geocaching. So while I was on vacation, which was not, it was, it was vacation. Like you were probably identified as vacation, but it was like a working vacation. Um, we were going out to do the, the geocaching stuff, which was a huge hunk of physical work. But also my friend Cheryl had died, which we sort of talked about. And they're instead of in lieu of having a funeral because COVID and for other myriad of reasons, um, they didn't want to do a funeral. And I totally get it because um, just as Ohio is apparently a hotbed of COVID activity, so is Nevada. Um, that's cool. And so they were doing like an open house thing on a on a on a date but it was not a date that we were coming and it actually worked out so that we came on a day when like there wasn't a ton of other people. Um, and I spent several hours with the family. And I'm glad that it happened that way because I feel like, I feel like I got to, to have the family like undivided and it was good for me that was very nice maybe that 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 could be selfish I don't no I'm not sorry I got I got the family undivided and unto myself and I had a very quality experience with them and it felt like there was many remembrances of Cheryl and many remembrances with the kids and meeting new new members of the family. And that was really good. I'm glad that it happened that way. Also, then it's like we're also not bringing like a million strangers. You know what I'm saying? Like we didn't have to mix with a ton of people either. So that was good, but we did, what's this girl? <coughs> oh. I have funny mouth. You're a goofy funny girl. Look, that looks right. Oh my goodness. Anyway, anyway, um, we did accomplish our goal numbers wise geocaching 
Um, we did some sub goals as well. One of those was to have 400 caches found in a day. We did that on the ET highway because that's kind of the place where you're going to get to do that. So that earns me the highest Project GC badge gen award for that. I'm a diamond level. Ooh. Are you going to upload this? Yeah. That's weird. <laughs> anyway, um, so we did that. I got, um... I, I figured out like 590 was right about where I needed. And when we came home, I it literally took days to log that. I think, in fact, last night I finished logging the family. And today it's Tuesday. So Monday the 14th, it took me all that time. It's like 2,500 caches. I know we kind of talked about that before. <sighs> anyway, this is like chat and a show. Um <laughs> I needed like 12 caches or something like I did allow myself a buffer amount so we came home and on Saturday I think we did eight and then we did like <laughs> four more or something on Sunday whatever I'm on track now where I need just one oh. one a day and um so here's the way it goes and I'm gonna just kind of boil this down the 2,000 caches in a year we have completed that the next goal is to finish the 366 calendar. Tomorrow on Wednesday, the 16th, we, me and Chris finish ours. On the Christmas day, the 25th, what you doing there, buddy? The kids finish their 366 calendar. On the 31st, we finish the entire 2020 calendar year. One find every day. Every day we went and found something. And then our final goal, you have to get in closer on the shot. Our final goal is to um, oh, cuddle with you. Is the 366 physical caches, which ends on January 26th. Because I found virtual caches on the 25th or the 26th last year and didn't get any physical caches because like a big dodo. We're always coming in the video, but we never get in the first time when you said Anywho, so that's the update. So goals are being accomplished. They're falling like rain right now and we just gotta keep it up. It's basically no snow but it's very, very cold. And I'm talking to the wind tonight. You're gonna talk to the wind tonight? Yeah, I'm not. Oh, okay. Anyway, so I'm gonna wrap up for this. Oh no 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 yeah, because my hands I can't hold it anymore. There's nothing but kids. Kids in my way. Woo, 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 woo. <laughs> no, I'll be back in a few. Um. All right, so it's 10 after 10 right now. Uh, I just got the last load out of the dryer, brought it up, got that load upstairs, put all of it away. So all of the laundry is washed and dried and put away um, that was going to get washed today. Uh, so, so there's no, nothing in the washer and nothing in the dryer right now, which is thumbs up good. Uh, the next goal is, <laughs> okay, so I know I've showed you this hot mess happening right here, but this and this and then this box, these all need to go to my mom's house and I've asked my children to please, oh, and, um, that also we used those some of those to make the pie crust for thanksgiving if you watch that vlog so it's my goal is to get those things out of my house today at 11 o'clock we drive up to the school which is like right around the corner um and pick up their school lunches so if i can get that stuff out that will go a long way to like making this much cleaner and then probably what i will do is um like like this letter towel these these things i can kind of sweep up i will redo do you see how dirty that is and the kids are like we don't need that we need that because that is like so much crud that is not going to be permanently adhered to the couch which is a real pita to wash um like we have to pay extra for it. I don't like that. Or I can throw that washy th that thing in the wash. I'm not doing that today though. Um, so that's what I'm gonna do. And then maybe these guys, these bulbs, we're gonna deal with 
getting the last of the stuff on the tree and then putting away the bulbs we don't use for now. So I feel like that is a tall order. <laughs> That's a lot of things to do because I'm starting to get like a little tired. I'm going to sit down and have some hot to drink and rest for a minute maybe even sit and do some computer work. I did also transfer files from here to the, from here to there to the computer. So I could edit, but I just, I'm not really feeling like editing a whole lot, but we'll see. The point is, is that I'm filming because like I said, editing, having something to edit is way easier than like having to produce content because like it's going to take me a lot of the day today to do this stuff and share it with you <laughs> and it's hard to rush that whereas like I can jam out some um some editing I can do that actually pretty quick so um that's where we're gonna go from there so it's Thursday morning now I woke up and I had a good deal of energy and I know that because I got up and immediately changed the trash my very full trash. Got the kids in school, that's cool. I sat down and um, worked on some planner stuff, which is good. I wrote out all the rest of my Christmas cards because you know, <laughs> seven days is not that long um, when it comes to mail at Christmas. So um, I got that done. Everyone's in school and now I'm gonna go upstairs and film the ads. That's my plan anyway. Um, Oh man, I hate when I put stuff on the stairs. And as I go up, there's not enough hands to carry all of it. So um, I did get that stuff upstairs, so it's not downstairs, but it is not put away, obviously. Um, so it's upstairs. I came upstairs to film the ad so I could have a little bit of peace because in theory, the kids are all in school. Uh, anyway, um, I did write out like four or five Christmas cards, oh, some online drama happened, not with me, peripherally, I proffered as much advice as I could, <sighs> okay, I don't have a pen and stuff, look at all this trash I have, actually I need to take some of that stuff down, okay, so, I have a ton of pens. Planner pens. All right, I'm gonna cut this one off. I'm gonna film my other one. <laughs> Cause I am trying to like do this everyday thing and I need this one for today. You know, cause leaving it to the last minute. 